Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com, new Windows 10 build to look at. This is build 20236 from Windows Insiders on the dev channel. Not a huge amount to show you in this build, but there are some couple of interesting features. You can now see the refresh rate in the display settings, so let's take a look at that. Notice how you get the uh, splash colour there as well. So you go here to advanced display settings. And here you can see the refresh rate. Now you couldn't have that before, but apart from going through the old display settings in the uh, sort of the old control panel style way of doing it. So those are the two options that are available on my uh, Surface Go. So that's the main change. The other changes with this build, you can see you've got um, improved access to PDF narrator for screen readers, which is which is good. So the fixes are they've fixed an issue with uh, Microsoft Edge is no longer available messages that a few people have had coming up. They've fixed some uh, watchdog and violation errors and those usual kind of bugs. they fixed some narrator issues. Uh, they fixed issues with timeline not launching the correct app. Um, and they fixed an issue that was breaking the NVIDIA um, acceleration for Linux. There's still some known issues with this build. So there's still a known issue with um, applications will fail to install Windows install a service on x86 systems. So 64-bit systems are affected. Um, so that's quite a big one. You won't be able to install anything on all the 32-bit systems. So they're still looking at the old issue with, hang with build hanging for extended period times. They're still not seeing that. Um, and these some of the ones hanging around here about the uh, pin sites and things like that. And the other one is this one from last week as well with a taskbar issue with the power button. But I don't think I'm seeing that. No, I'm not the power. So I don't think I'm seeing that. No, I'm not. So there you go. So those are the changes with this build. We've got the new setting for uh, refresh rates and um, the PDF changes, and that's about it. So you can find out more on thedigitallifestyle.com. I'm at iSticks on Twitter. Thanks for watching this build video, and I'll see you on the next one.